Hey guys, it's Elise, and I'm going to be showing you how to make the classic lemon scrub. So, you're going to need lemons, of course, olive oil, extra virgin or doesn't really matter, just olive oil, bright white granulated sugar, or brown sugar, whatever you want, and then you're going to need like a cheese grater like that, an empty container, and a bowl to mix it, a spoon, and uh, like a knife that is kind of safe and um, you're gonna need like a spatula or something to get it out from the behind of the cheese grater and then you're gonna need lemon flavor and um, a spoon and a cutting board so after you have like grated all of your um, your lemons they should kind of look like this. I'll show you how you do it. So you take the handle and then it's it should be on like a flat plate. If that's the easiest. And you take like the side of your lemon and you have to go up and down. Don't go on the really big ones because then it doesn't exactly work. And don't go on the two small ones because that doesn't work either. So just go on the medium and then it'll like get white. Just want to do that the whole way around your lemon. And then, see, after, like, every, every, like, what, one minute or two minutes that you do this, like, the, um, this stuff with the lemon, then you're going to stop for a second, and, um, this is all from these two, but stop, and inside here is, like, all the, all that stuff, so you take your spatula and you pull it all out, and then you go like that, so you just do that every time that you keep doing your lemons. And then you just do this the whole way around until your lemon's done. You don't, there's no like specific amount of lemons. It really depends on how big your jar is. If it's like really small, like that big or something, then you're only gonna need about one lemon. You don't need any more than that. Um, and it makes a lot of whatever it's called, like shredded um, lemon stuff. And just so you know, for this project, you cannot use lemonade. It just doesn't really work like that. And then, um, just do that. And don't forget to take this out, because if you don't, then it won't, then it's not going to really grade and, like, come out. Okay, yeah. So you kind of get it now. And then you just do that with two and a half of your lemons. And then you take one of your lemons and you have to cut it. Make sure your hands are on either side so you don't hurt yourself. And you cut it like this. And you do that. I'm going to just start with one, but you can always cut another one. So bring out your bowl and bring out your sugar. So open your sugar, and I have like this little scooper thingy, and um, I would say about one cup. About like one cup of this, and then you're going to take your olive oil, extra virgin or not. And then it should have something like that or something you can pour out of. And then take about three tablespoons. But it really, again, depends on how big your jar is. So make sure you get it all in there. So like I said, three tablespoons and one cup of the sugar. But it, again, like I just said, it really does depend on how big your jar is. My jar is pretty big, so I have to make a lot. And if you're making it for like a gift, then you might want to fill it all the way to the top. And you might have to, and then just take your lemons. If you have like a 
lemon squeezer, you can use that, but I'm just going to use my hands. You can take the seeds out too. Every lemon has a seed. It's normal. Nah, can't get it. So slippery. Okay, now mix that all together. So even half of a lemon is a lot of lemon juice. Like I didn't even finish the whole lemon. Like it's a lot of it. So just start with half a lemon and you know if you need more then you just cut more or you just use the other one. And you get that all out. It's okay with pulp. It's fine. And then you have to mix it all. And if there's too much, you just add more sugar. It really doesn't hurt to add more. Just add like a tad bit more. And then, so now it should be more like, um, more rough and stiff. So like that. Like this. And then take all your all your um, lemon. Like I can't remember what it's called. And then just put it in here, put some of it in here. And then not just will it make color, but it'll it'll make it very bright and good for you. So just mix it all in. Make sure you get it all mixed in. Get it all out there. Like that. So now it's a more of a yellow color. That's nice. And then um, if you don't if you don't think it's lemony enough, then you can add lemon flavor. But you really don't need it. I'm gonna add a teeny, teeny tiny bit. It smells really good. Just a little bit. Like a teeny teeny tiny bit. But really you don't you don't really need it. It's it's quite optional. And also limes do work for this, but it takes a little a little bit longer to get them like graded and stuff. Get the zents out of them. It's okay if some, some of these little things are bigger than the other ones. You just want them in your scrub. And you might have to take, you might have to take two batches so you can um, get it all in your, like fill it all the way up. So then you're just gonna take it all and pour it into your, into your um, little container whatever your container is and then just want to get all of it in there and see like mine I'm gonna have to make more but that's okay if it doesn't fit then just watch this video over again and you'll get it back so there is your lemon scrub and it's awesome with your hands. I can even feel it on my fingers. It's awesome stuff. It really works. And just so you know, make sure you moisturize after you put it on your hands. So, let's try it out. Super, super soft, like so soft. So all you have to do is you take some of it, just a little bit, put it in your hands, you have to rub it here and like out on the back of your hand, 
and then you just put it under water and then you take it out and you wash. And also you can use it in the shower or the bath or anything and you just scrub it on your whole body and then you wash it off and then moisturize. Just make sure you moisturize because when it gets near the winter time then it'll be really helpful. So thanks for watching. Bye!